Well, we've certainly seen problems in the past, and Friday night traffic will likely be a big challenge again before the Air Force Academy football game. KRDO News Channel 13 Scott Harrison is live at the Academy's South Gate this evening to explain. Scott. The Air Force Academy season opener two weeks ago was also parents weekend, adding to the size of the crowd. Officials even asked us to help get the word out and ask fans to arrive early and be aware of heavier traffic. We've seen tremendous backups, you know, even miles out the gates. But an Academy graduate we spoke with says we can't compare preparations for Falcon games with games at non-military campuses. You got to realize that it's a working operational base and there's 4,000 cadets right up there that we have to keep secure. So that's their number one priority. That may not go over well for fans stuck in traffic on the way to the game. But Academy officials say that they've learned lessons from the home game two weekends ago and will apply them for Friday evening's game. Right now we're trying to figure out the, the, the roundabout. What we're going to try to do is we're going to try to filter them, you know, from three lanes to two lanes prior to the roundabout so that way people want to go where they want to go. So that way it doesn't cause as many traffic impacts. Academy officials expect a smaller crowd Friday for the game that was switched from Saturday a month ago for TV purposes. The real test could come next Saturday when Academy rival Navy comes to town and will likely be a sellout. But officials say it won't be anything like the traffic nightmare that happened during the Avalanche's hockey game here two years ago. Let's hope not. The Academy says for the season opener, around half the fans used each of the two gates. Officials say continuing that and having fans arrive early should prevent any major problems.